what is common to a fish seller in the markets of Dhaka, a school teacher in Kigali, a jazz musician in the French quarter of New Orleans, a Beijing opera artist, a football fan in the favelas of Rio, and a baker in Oslo. They all live in cities and struggle to survive in the face of global poverty and rising inequality. Humanity crossed an important milestone in the early 21st century. For the first time in over 5,000 years, there are more of us that live in cities and towns than in villages. By 2030, we expect nearly 60% of us to be living in urban areas. Cities are the most productive places on the planet. They are the sites of opportunity that create hundreds of millions of new jobs, help bring families out of poverty, and help produce wealth. If we plan wisely, cities can show the way out of many of our current developmental and environmental challenges. The United Nations Sustainable Development Goals recognize that the future of our planet, our people, and their prosperity depends crucially on the quality of our cities and the way people live in them. The SDGs, especially SDG 11, calls to make cities inclusive, safe, resilient and productive, and therefore sustainable by 2030. All of us, no matter where we live, no matter what we do, need to get involved in making our cities, towns and villages more sustainable. Join me and my colleagues from across the world to understand the challenges facing our urban areas and the opportunities to make them more sustainable. In this course, we will explore how cities are organized and the role they play in our economy and society. The challenges are immense and diverse, but if we make the right choices, the opportunity of a sustainable future is within reach in about a generation. Each one of you has a stake in making our cities more inclusive, productive and sustainable. Our time to act is now.